guys, we are here in the Axadelphia practice lanes and today we're going to be going over another top five video, but this time we're going to be going over the top five accessories for you to have if you're participating in an axe throwing league. There are a couple things that are going to make your life a lot easier, going to make it so you're not running around looking for your axe, and are going to make it so your axe sticks a lot more uh, when you're actually throwing a league. So the first accessory we're going to go over is going to be a bag to carry your axes. Once you join a league, you're probably going to get your own big axe, you're probably going to have multiple of your regular axes just in case something happens to your main one, and in that case, you're going to want to have your own bag. You're going to want to find a bag that allows you to carry your big axe with you. Finding one that either allows your big axe to stick out of the back or is big enough to actually hold the whole thing is what you're going to need to do. Keep an eye out for our Top Throwing Axe Bag video, which should be coming out soon. It'll give you a couple options to choose from, and you'll be able to find one that really works for the type of axes that you have. Alright, so second up on our list, we're going to talk about holsters. Having a holster for your axe is a great thing when you're participating in a league. There is nothing worse than getting your name called out and not being able to find your axe. If you have a holster, you've always got it right at your side. You can pull it right out and have it ready to go anytime. Take a look at axedelphia.com to check out some of our holsters, handmade by myself. Uh, you should be able to find one on there that you like. I'll put a link down below in the description. Number three on our list is going to be custom sheets. Having a sheet that is fit perfectly for your axe is super durable and isn't going to cut through if you've been moving your axe around in your bag a lot and stuff like that is the greatest. Picking up one of the Axadelphia sheets that we have available is always a good idea. We've got three layers of leather there, so you're not going to be hitting on this string or any of these studs at all. You'll be able to find sheets like this one and others on our store. If you look on there, you should be able to find one that fits whatever type of axe that you're currently from. Now we're going to be getting into the really important stuff. This is the stuff that's going to actually affect your throwing and is going to make a difference in real competition. Something really important to have is going to be a sanding block or a grinding block. Something like that is going to allow you to get that final finish on your axe. You're going to be able to run this along the blade here and that's going to get you that final sharpened edge that you really need to be able to stick in the fresh new boards. The most important item that we're going to cover is going to be a metal file or a belt sander. These items can kind of cover the same grounds, whereas they're going to take a lot of material off of your blade, and they're going to get that new blade that you have ready for competition. When you get a new blade, either one of the show pros, or something that you bought online on eBay or Etsy, the chances are the profile is not going to be where it needs to be for you to stick on new boards like this. So pick up a belt sander or a metal file and just grind all of that extra meat off of the blade. It's going to get the profile down to a thin edge that you really want and it's going to allow you to penetrate these fresh boards easily. It really is what allows you to take any axe and turn it into a great throwing axe. Yo, sick in 